Hello, it's your boy from 1996. Welcome back to the episode of Highly Recommended. In this episode, we're playing the RS-8. They're playing a game which is Contra, which is not Contra. And instead, is a strange bootleg game based off of Pokemon. It's a platformer in which you play a Pikachu, which I also believe was also on, like, this, like, multi-cart that my cousin owned back in the day for the Game Boy Advance. Along with that, it was also, um... I think it was also on the Super Nintendo too, but basically it's a platformer featuring this very odd-looking Pikachu, which I think it's supposed to look green on, my, on the end of the game? No, it's yellow. But yeah, this is a platformer featuring Pikachu. All you do is jump around, defeat enemies, you can also attack by a full screen attack by doing the other button, which of course causes a flash, you know, it's a seizure attack essentially. So there's no ash to comically suffer from the attack. There we go. You use that attack or- that looks like a cheap- a recolored Chi Chi cheap cheat sprite from Mario Brothers. But you either do that or you just jump on them like it's you know, your basic platformer. Oh also, yeah, the only thing you can't bounce on is those uh... those uh... boxes? No boxes, the rocks, what am I saying? Bounce on those, you uh, get hurt for some reason, even though they're not enemies. I think these are supposed to be like something else, but given their sprite shape, I'm assuming they're like recolored clefairies. Alright, you go down. Oh, okay! The cloud can only come here like once you step on it, so you gotta get on it fast. Oh god, it's. War Turtle? I was gonna say it's, it's, it looked like Beedrill for a second, but. It definitely looks more like War Turtle, which is strange because War Turtles can't fly with those wings on their heads. They got some weird octopuses. Okay, touching those kill me. Why does this tree look like it's like in pain? All right, so I'm guessing dying, of course, sends you all the way back. But I wonder if that life respawned essentially by going all the way back. Yeah, so this is your basic platformer. You can only get up to three batteries, it seems. Doesn't make any sense, really. Okay, I can just kill that like that, so what's the point of the screen killer? I can just do that for most of the game. I'm gonna go down here to get that extra life point. Okay, can only have three life points. I wasted that, and I died again! Okay, it looks like everything just respawns if you, if you restart from, uh, when you, like, lose your life. So if that's the case, and I should might as well go ahead and just breeze through the game without having to really collect any of the power-ups since you can barely stock them up unless you've used them prior. Yeah, that rock hit me despite not being near it that much. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. So the game basically won't end at all, because, you know, you're always going to get that extra life. Oh, shoot. I gotta be careful, because that octopus thing might be there. And that will definitely kill me for certain if I'm not careful. It looks like I can't seem to jump on it. So they're like the rocks, essentially. Oh, no, not... Sp oh, come on. <gasps> yes, a hit point. Okay, the cloud would fall down, I kind of figured. Let me take the easier route here. What is this thing? It looks like a troll mixed with Yoda. Alright, I bounce on that. That's pretty lucky of me. Let's go get rid of this thing. If that's a bird, then I'm wrong here. What? Okay, well, uh, that happened. Let's gotta kill these things. It's easier that way than having to deal with them at all. Wait, can I use this on that? Nope. What can I kill the rock? Somehow, rock is enemy. And the rock can kill me. I guess it does make sense 
But the rock's not a geodude or anything. No, I guess what we count as a rock type. Oh, that's just cool. This is a spike that comes down there. Okay, never mind. I was entirely wrong on the eye. What? And that didn't even touch my hitbox. No way! Alright, we made it to the end of the level. I didn't expect to actually go this far. Well, now with that, we can't. What? Bullets? Why are there bullets in the world of Pokemon? They don't use guns, because that was all centered down by four kids. Ouch. Well, at least my freaking power up thing, like, respawned essentially. Oh my, what is shooting this Pikachu? Ah! Okay, can't hurt that. That's good to know. What was that? It was a really, really weird high pitch for a second there in the song. Was that Clefairy? No, 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 no. Was that Jigglypuff trying to make me go to bed? You hear that? It's happening again. The freaking weird high pitch. Go kill that weird cheap cheap bird thing. Gee, come on! The game keeps drawing. Wait, how? How? I don't know how to hit not hit me. The hitboxes are ridiculous in this game. Also, what's with the like the, the geometry at the level? <laughs> what's happening? <laughs> no game on. Gotta ruin them all. Okay, at least it can. Did it just respawn? Was that a freaking Ninja Gaiden respawn? Are you for real? Freaking Ninja Gaiden up in here. I am not Ryu Hayabusa, I am Pika freaking Chew. Okay, I know that one destroys projectile, but still. Okay. As long as I. I really did not think that one through. Okay. Extra health. Perfect. I need that as much as I can, considering how the BS of the game is throwing at me. Oh, that's not fair. Wait! I jumped on it! No way that thing hit me twice! Oh, oh, oh god. No, 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 Pikachu! Okay, at least I still have a life. I you use this to destroy the bullets? No, I cannot. I kind of figured that bullets wouldn't be survived. Freaking steel type bullets. Maybe this is the world where everyone, like, maybe, like, has an amalgamation of an old Pokemon NES game invading the other world, but it's like the uh, freaking ROM hack too many times like Alpha Rad. So that's where we have Spike Ball here, which is the Spike type, and Bullets for the Gun type Pokemon. I like putting in my own set of logic by using other sources, because it makes it funnier in a sense. But you kind of get the idea, considering how bad shit and cra crazy these freaking bootlegs can get, anyways. Like, look, if we get bullets are coming out and trying to kill Pikachu, we have, like, some kind of unusual snipers. Come! What? I don't understand you, Pokemon! What is this noise? Pikachu's happy that he gets to die again. <laughs> I don't know what I can do with this, chilling because this is an insane platformer that is making things harder purely because of its BS. <laughs> Did you see? I'm sorry, didn't mean to make that noise, but at the same time, what just happened? I was so low, I was apparently so low in the ground with my hitbox, I instantly got KO'd by the death zone there. The empty void of, well, I'm assuming, water or something, because Pikachu can't... <laughs> That's impossible for me to die in water. I'm electric. To... I can run? That just makes things worse. 
<laughs> okay, so I have a run button. That should be good to outrun things. But I'm already on my last life, and honestly, the game has already thrown so much BS at <laughs> the hitboxes! <laughs> Freaking Pikachu! Bullets and bullshit. <laughs> I'm just trying to get through this game, and this game is giving me more reasons to stop than actually play it any further. I mean, just given what I've been experiencing. What? No, no, you don't, like, patrol. When do they start patrolling areas? When is that established? Oh god. No, there's two of them. No, come on, Pikachu, you can jump on them. WHY CAN'T I JUMP ON IT ALL OF A SUDDEN?! This game is not making- ah! I went through the floor? Pikachu, you're gonna have to go to sleep for a long time. We'll have to put you down. I'm sorry, but... No, your world does not make any sense. And then Pikachu died. I think I know why I never touched this on the Game Boy Advance. Okay, goodbye. See y'all in the next episode. Pikachu, why? Why did you have to be caught in this game?